Thanks for with us on this Thursday edition of Take 5 of the Journey and I uh, want to share with you today about repentance. What repentance is. In 2 Corinthians 7 uh, verse 9 it says, Now I rejoice not that you were made sorry, but that your sorrow to repentance. You know, some people are just sorry about what they did. I, I'm sorry. Uh, God, I'm, I'm sorry. We're really repenting to God and we can repent to a person. But if you say you're sorry, that's not repentance. That's just the first step of hopefully that godly sorrow moveth you to repentance. Repentance is this. You're heading this way and then all of a sudden now you're heading this way. It's go, you're going in an opposite direction from where he was at. You turned your back upon that thing, and then you're heading this way. You know, uh, you can just destroy your life. You can do all kinds of dumb things in life. But if you truly repent to God, that's the only thing that will take you above all this junk and all your bad choices. It takes you where you're above it, where God, I'm not going that way anymore. I repent, I've been dead wrong. And so I've been heading this way, I'm heading this way. And you know what that does? It sets you above the stuff. I don't know if you've ever really had to repent super hard about things. I have in my life. I'll never forget when I got saved, I, the guy told me, the preacher told me, and I didn't know anything about it. Ask God to forgive you for everything in your life. And I, I was trying to think of everything that I ever did in my life that was wrong. I, I, I couldn't, I just didn't have that kind of memory. And, but I said, God, I do repent of that lifestyle. And you know what? There was a cleansing that happened in my life. There was a freedom that happened in my life. And there was things that I had never, ever experienced. I mean, I felt like I was going to, straight toward heaven because God cleaned me up and he took all that junk off of our lives. You may be listening to me by accident today, but you know what? You may need to repent. If you'll repent, you can get above things because God will help you if you'll turn your back upon sin. I love you. I want you to say to yourself this day, God is a good God and the devil's a bad devil.